Hey everyone, it's Jenny Bloggins here, and I'm gonna do a uh, Wings of Isis spread, okay? So it's called the Wings of Isis spread because it will help lift you into a new understanding. I'm shuffling, and I want you to keep an open heart and an open, open mind. That one wants to come out, be the first card. And I'm going to try to fan them out as it as it um, instructs me to do so, but I don't have enough room in my camera for that. Okay. And I want you to uh, keep an open heart, keep an open mind, and either ask for guidance in unconditional love, generally, or in a specific issues. Okay. So I'm going to lay out the five cards from left to right. Some of them are trying to jump out already. That one already jumped out. So I'll ask the question and then I'll read the back of the card. Okay. One, another one flipped over. So we're going to put that one. Another one wanted to come out. So we're going to flip that one. Hmm. Divine Destiny. I'm hearing you're in your Divine Destiny. That's going to be the title of this video. Divine Destiny. Oh, one more. Okay. Bottom of the deck, Serpent of Fire. That one just came out in another, in, in the one card, one truth um, pool that I did. So, first question. What is the real issue for me right now on a spiritual level? I'm hearing you're afraid, but you're going to get over that fear, right? Temple of Lapis Lazuli, so maybe you should look into that um, stone for yourself. Your soul is a very ancient and very, your soul is very ancient and holds the wisdom of star peoples from civilizations with a unique high vibrational awareness that can help humanity transform from a culture-based sphere into a love-based community. You are here on this planet to be you to the fullest extent possible. Then you will help heal human culture so that the planet may thrive. That is beautiful. So what's the next one? How can I best heal that in my day-to-day -day life? The dark mysteries. The dark goddess calls you to her inner chamber where she holds a test and a gift for you. The test is your willingness to meet and release the fears within that have been secretly holding you back. The gift is freedom, peace, opportunity, and prosperity in all forms. Will you accept her call? Your time for deeper initiation is here. What will the gift or outcome of this be? Proper burial for freedom. There is nothing to be gained and everything to be lost by trying to hold on to that which no longer serves us. Osiris, Lord of the Dead, guides you now to release that which no longer needs to be a part of your life so that you may be free. Okay, sorry I had to take a little break, handle something real quick, but I'm back now. So number four, what is the biggest challenge or opportunity for me to get the best outcome? We have this beautiful full card here. And it say, stay true and be in your power. You are a sovereign divine being with spiritual authority and freedom within. You do not need permission from anyone to be who you are and live your life as you choose. This is your divine birthright. Guard it as it is the precious treasure that guard it as the precious treasure that it is and remember that you are a divine being free to be you okay five what special guidance is there to help me resolve this in the best way now and this is a beautiful card as well i love it it's one of my favorites uh sirius is a celestial goddess a star of unconditional love and wisdom at an extremely high vibration she brings a deep soul awakening spiritual gifts and high capacity for divine service she asks you to pay attention now because something significant is taking place at a spiritual level for you at this time okay guys thank you so much for watching my channel please like comment share and subscribe if it resonated with you Please check out my other videos. Is more from. Please check out my other videos. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.